to these. Well, as you know and stuff, you can see, or you can see I have both my hands using and it, so I got myself a nice little stand to hold, hold while I do this. So, uh, like I said, Monday is my anniversary, so I put $20 into anniversary stuff. And we also decided to go see a movie instead of go bowling. So I put $10 in there so we can get drinks um, for that. We knew we were going to eat anything afterwards because we just had dinner. I put $100 in for my car payment. And uh, I had to give my daughter, my oldest daughter, $100 for an emergency she had. So I had to take $100 out of my emergency car fund to give her that. But then I put the other $100 that was supposed to be extra money for my emergency car fun yeah it was a mess it, it was a really big mess but i have the money back in there again plus i added ten dollars woo ten dollars more but my car's really needing to get that radiator done so yeah um yeah so i'm working on that still i'm hopefully hoping some extra money comes in next week so i can get this done next weekend and then be done with it in. I was planning on putting four different things, but I had to cross it out. Other stuff came up, and twenty dollars for gas that I'm gonna get tomorrow. So that's how I broke down everything. Now as you can see my nutrition things out to the side. I'm actually thinking of not going to my nutrition anymore and turning this into a mom fund for my mom and. Yeah, I turn it into a car emergency card for like that, just in case anything ever happens to my mom, I can go back for her. Um, I also do want to do a house repair one. Don't need it right now because we don't have a house, but we are house looking. Like I said, um, last weekend we were supposed to house hunt this weekend, and uh, yeah, it didn't go very well. We had a couple of things that we really liked went off really quickly before um, before we even had a chance to look at it. I was sad, but. We will find I'm going to do the same thing for my dad as I'm doing for my mom and I'm going for that just in case I have to ever go um, get my dad um, anywhere that he is. Uh, he is a trucker, so he travel, travels across the United States all the time. I'm sure that if anything ever happens to my dad, I have to bring him home or uh, anything like that, I can do that. And because my oldest money, my oldest daughter bought all money. I'm going to put some money off to the side just in case one day she's going to need it again. And then I'm going to do a um, budget thing for my youngest daughter. I'm going to start giving her allowance. So that's an update on those. And um, you're probably sitting there going, that's a lot of envelopes. And I'm sitting here saying, yeah, they are. <clears throat> so let me go over this. So like I said, I put $20 in there, had $25, I took full $25 out. So now there is zero in this, but my anniversary's done, so I don't have to worry about that anymore, but I'm just still going to put $5 into this. And then I took outing money too, like I said, what about that stein for my, um, the big bottle, I think it's called a stein, I don't know, deal. But I took the extra outing money, the $15 out of there for my outing money. For that too as well so that's empty and then like I said uh, put ten dollars in for movies because I really didn't know what we were going to be using for money uh, movies but um, yeah we ended up using ten dollars I still have five so that money is going to go back in there and then so I had all that money in my account. I was just going to leave it there. But you know what? Every time I look at the account, I'm like, ooh, I can buy this. I can do that. And it's like, da, da, da. And I keep forgetting that I'm going to need um, the repair. And then I look at, oh, yeah, I don't, don't have any there. So I put 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 200, 2, 4, and 6, so 260. That I wrote out there, took everything out so I don't use it for anything else. And that's going for my emergency car. So I can get that going. So I have 260. I still have another 400. 
Okay, sorry about that. So yeah, I have another four hundred dollars on this to go to get my radiator done. Hopefully, like I said, that extra money will come in, and I can get my radiator done next weekend. And I don't have to worry about that, and I can start saving for other things that I have, like uh, the brakes. I still need to get the back brakes done on my car, and the tire sensor is driving me insane. And that's one hundred and forty dollars to switch that sensor out on my car too, as well. But yeah, I am planning on making more envelopes for other things for the house repairs when we get house. Uh, my dad, my daughter, my oldest daughter, uh, emergency things along with my mom's emergency because I think I'm really going to turn this one to my mom's emergency. And then start doing my daughter's um, allowances because she's really been asking about those. So that is everything. Um, everything all together. I mean, it really doesn't look like a lot. I mean, this is all my major bill stuff. And then my debt for my sinking funds. Let's see. Ah, can't grab them. There we go. And then these are my debt ones. So, I mean, it's not that bad. And as long as I'm getting my debt paid off, which I am still am, that it's really nice it's going smoothly on that I love doing the automatic payments on that it helps so much on this um, it is nice that you know even though I'm not showing any money in my account I can sit here and still look at this and go oh hey I got money for a trip still I can do I was like oh I got money emergency money in case something happened uh, birthday coming up definitely since my birthday is coming up I want to be able to do something nice for my daughter and then Christmas, saving up Christmas money. I mean, it's nice to know that I can still save up money for stuff for later in the year. So if anything happens, it's all in there. So, I mean, it's nice having my cards and doing this. I am really enjoying doing these cards this way and all that. So, yeah. I like this little cup. I don't know why. I just keep playing with it. I need to find a road and put it right here. That way I can have my purple rose. Because that's what I'm called, the purple rose. Because I love purple. And roses are soft and sweet. But yet, they are still nasty if you pick prick a thorn. So, and that's just like life. Life goes nice and smooth, and then every now and again, you get pricked by something, you got a little thorn. You got a little something happen. But yeah, that's how things for me. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next week. Bye.